Badsha, good morning. What's up? Good morning. How are you? I am good. Uh, still a little sleepy, but yeah, really mm -hmm. good. <laughs> I mean, I don't know where to start with you, Badsha, because firstly, you have been so busy. I mean, you don't stop. When do you take a break? Do you ever take a break? <laughs> I'm actually taking a break right now. Uh, are you? Which, yes, which has come after a long time. Uh, uh, I've come to my city, I've come to Chandigarh, and uh, I'm just chilling. I plan nice. to go to the mountains for a while, and that's like two, three days, and get back to the grind, the hustle. That sounds good to me. And you know what? It's nice to know that you've taken out a little bit of time just to wind down because it gets very busy for you. Your life is on the go all the time. But what I do want to say is, I think I'm your good luck charm. Shall I tell you why? Why? Because a lot of your tracks I've made my track of the week, you know, like Say Yes to the Dress, Barney Bunny, now Voodoo. I feel like I should take a bit of credit, basically. I get it. I think the credit, I think the credit is due, perhaps. Thank you so much. Oh, I, is it? Oh, yes. Yes. You yes. tell him. You wow. tell him. See? This well, is what guys, I mean. Of course. Yes, yes. Sure. I'm, wow. Wow. Thanks. I feel lucky. No, I'm, I mean, I need it this time more than ever <laughs> because uh, the expectations are so high. Um, you know, the, the just, it, it's a big record. And uh, um, I don't know, it's like, I haven't done any, anything like this before. Um, the, the amount of the record is, is big. Uh, the way it's being, uh, you know, Treated is really big. I, I, it's for the first time I'm, I am experiencing all this. Um, so yeah, I need it more than ever, Haps. Please. <laughs> well, you've always got my back, and you know that anyway. But I have to say, this, this track itself, the minute you dropped the picture on your social media and we saw it on Instagram, I felt like I had to take like not just a double look, a triple look. I was like, oh my god, is this actually happening? But it's really nice, and I, and I keep saying this on my breakfast show quite a lot that. I really like when you see collaborations that you just don't expect. Like, you know, when you just yeah. don't see it come in and then it happens yeah. and you're like, whoa, this is going to be good. But the, the, the amazing thing about yourself and Jay Balvin, of course, who's on the track, is that you both have a very similar sound in your music. So what took so long to do this? Why didn't you do this ages ago? <laughs> well, I, I, uh, uh, I DM'd him a long time ago. Uh, I DM'd him in 2019, but he didn't reply. So... I had to what wait did you to say? Hear. What did you say? What was in the DM? Not, nothing. I just, uh, you know, I was at the headquarters of uh, uh, YouTube and I saw his picture and it was, it, it was his picture and uh, it was written redefining mainstream. And I was just so proud of it because, you know, he's been an idol for me uh, because, you know, uh, I aspire to do what he has done for Latin music. I aspire to do the same for, the, for my music, for mm -hmm. Hindi music or for Desi music. Um, and I just posted it and I was hoping he reads it and then uh -huh. you know, I followed him and reacted on his story but nah, nada. and then when <laughs> I met him I, I told him about it I was like wow you know what I, it's hardly that I don't reply to people I was like wow then I'm you know <laughs> I happens. don't know where I am <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I mean it was uh, it was just amazing to be in the same picture as in and to be able to collaborate and yeah we have similar sounds very similar sounds uh because it's sort of universal uh but yeah everything happens uh when the time comes so i think this this was the perfect time for that so once this dm happened once you got this response did you meet after that did you actually record the track in the studio together or was that a separate no. process and then you came together for the video, right? No, we could not because it happened during the uh, pandemic, pandemic. During the lockdown. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and that is also the reason why it was delayed a lot because we've been in, we, we've been, you know, uh, going back and forth with it for a long time. And, you know, as soon as we thought the things are about, to, you know, easy things about to open, suddenly something else came up. But uh, we met first for the first time um, on the sets of the uh, video and, um, uh, we instantly, you know, uh, had a vibe. Uh, he he made me listen to his songs with Ed Sheeran. Did he? And, you know, yeah, and he's done so many songs. I, I don't know if I'm allowed to say it or not, but he, <laughs> it's definitely more than two yeah. songs. And the best is yet to come. I was like, bro, why aren't you releasing these bangers? And he was like, yo, I mean, it's 
it was a wide, you know. Mm. It was there was there was two musicians coming together, and of course, then there was Tiny, the producer of the song, who's amazing when it comes to production and also a genuine human being. The whole team was amazing, and it was just a vibe. We vibed a lot. We chatted a lot. We, we spoke about families. He just became a father. You know, he was like, "Yo, give me some tips." I was like, "Bro, uh, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It's just it's it's." It's every day, you know. You take it as, as every day is a different every day. day. Mm-hmm. Every day is a different day. I, But then, you know, it was it was a vibe. It was a vibe. And you know, it's really nice to see that, Badja, because, like, you know, like you mentioned, it's nice for you to join, you know, our culture with with his and using that fusion on a track like this. I I just like the fact that you know you brought these two sounds together, and I feel like we need to see more of it. You know, like we've seen yeah. so many people now making those kind of moves while they're trying to. Like you know, we've seen Diljit with Tory Lanez. I know that Gurren Angelis teamed up with YG. Like it's really nice to do this crossover, and now yourself with J Balvin it's nice to prove to people that it it can happen that it is doable isn't it i think uh um how do i put it? this 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 is this has been on my agenda uh for a very long time um you know um it helps i don't think we need to prove to anyone you know i i think we we seek some sort of validation from the west or from this group of people but i think we you know the, the individuals that you spoke about dilji dasan also karanojla i think they're amazing artists mm-hmm. you know both of them have you know just crazy crazy talented and amazing artists yeah um i think we we they see people are we got one of the richest cultures it was just a matter of time yeah and uh, you know now that the resources have developed even more uh, you know uh, i think i think this this fusion this crossover whatever you want to call it is inevitable now and you know look at aruj afta i mean you know she's she's won a grammy i it's it's i i we are on the cusp of a revolution which is yeah. which is which can happen any moment you know these are the we're just knocking the buildings right now but we know you know we yeah. punjabis ek banda jata hai to sare fir wahi chale jate hain absolutely <laughs> it's just a, it's just a matter of time <laughs> that's exactly what it is and i love i love that you know you're putting that out there as well it's nice to be manifesting that positive energy like yeah these, i mean yeah. riz is winning oscar it's our time i'm telling you it's yes. our time like the next three years are going to be so definitive of this we are rewriting the culture we are rewriting history hubs yeah. and it's exciting it's so exciting it's so exciting i love you know, it anyway i'm here for it it reminds me of the time when uh, you know pmc was killing it jagid rishrich jason yeah. it just it i think we're back in those times yes it, you're right it, it does take us back to those times because this is how we felt back then when those kind of moments yes. happened and now it's yeah. happening again i love it i'm here for it like i said when i saw your picture i was like yes more of yes. this please more of this this is what i like yeah. um so you know talk to me a little bit about the video cuz you're always swagged out by the show this is one thing that you know everybody knows you for you have your own unique style how was it for you what what was that like who's well, idea I was, was going, <laughs> i was going up against j balwin right <laughs> i mean <laughs> i mean just step it up a little bit <laughs> yeah dude is like all over the place when it comes to not all of the in a good way like he's <laughs> everywhere when it comes to fashion yeah. and swag you know he, and you know i was like i was like whoa dude, what do i do it's i have to be in the same frame as mr <laughs> yeah. jose uh and you know i i was coming i i came out he looked at me was like okay 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 <laughs> i was like yeah man <laughs> that's how we do it <laughs> and it just works and Nice. it just worked you know it just worked and also like uh, uh he's he's a great mentor uh, and i look at him like that you know um he calls he randomly calls me video calls me and then he and he's walking on the streets of new york uh-huh. and he's like you know you got to do this now you got to do this and every word is like a lesson you know every word is diamond because that guy has hustled his way up to the tops uh and um, yeah man so it 
it's so yeah. nice it's just so nice yeah. to see that friendship you know forming as well yeah. because it it's just so how cool is that for you to be like sat there one day watching tv and jay balvin's just like randomly facetiming you on the streets like i was it, actually watching tv i don't know why i was watching tv i don't watch tv <laughs> There you go. I know everything. Um, anyway, talking about talking about collaborations, is there anybody? I mean, you might have something exclusive. Do you have an exclusive for me today? Oh, uh, not today, but I promise you, if, if it's if the next time I announce it, I'm gonna announce it uh, with you. Well, I you better you do. That. You say this every yeah. time, so you better do. But you know, I will. I'm pretty. <laughs> sh- I'm pretty sure that you do have a wish list, though. Like there must be. There must be a wish list that you've got that you know people that you want to work with. Is there any names that oh, you could tell me that you'd love to have on a track? Who would you want to work with? There's so many. Um, 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 I love Drake. I mean, everybody knows that I love Drake. I would love to collaborate with him. Um, Dua Lipa, you know, she's she's crazy. Yeah. Um, Carol G, Bad Bunny, Little Baby, so many of them. They're just yeah. crazy artists. I mean, anybody who's like who's a vibe, you know, and uh, I wanna collaborate with them so many i mean i think and i know i've said this to you many times before anyway like you you are an icon for us but you i feel like you are the desi icon for all of us in terms of you've got your signature stamp on everything and i think you know what i'm about to say you have this one thing where everybody knows you're on this track and for some reason i don't know why but every time i hear your tracks now I feel like I know when it's coming as well. So I'm talking about, you know, people like Jason Derulo who have their own little moments. Jason Derulo. You've also got, you know, like DJ Khaled. Khaled. Has there <laughs> ever been... Well, this... yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Has there ever been a moment where, or a track where you have forgot to put that in? I have. Have you? I have, have. I have. And, you know, when I'm shooting for it, um, the background dancers, you know, yeah. I like, I, I know them, like, you know, it's the same fraternity, the technicians, they yeah. come up to me, uh, Paji, is no I have that issue I was like, whoa, I forgot. <laughs> and then I've gone back and then I've put it. And, you know, even the music, even the video directors are like, Paji, you don't have the issue of Paji, you don't have the issue of Paji, you don't have the issue of Paji, you don't have the It's like, you know, it's like, it's like, it's like a scam. It's like a yeah. signature. But I love yeah. it. I but the thing is, you know, the more people listen to your tracks, so or even if they're hearing it for the first time, I feel like you you can just sense when it's about to come in and you try it and it's there. I love when that moment Perhaps, happens. You know how it, how how I got it? Um please tell me. I was, uh, I was with this uh I was like show boy batch. I was, I don't know, I was with this kid. She was like four or five, you know. Uh Mariam was her name. I remember uh, clearly I was in Kanpur. And it was Mariam, very sweetly. I, I was just saying, Ishu boy, watch. I don't know where she heard me. I was talking to somebody like on the phone, I don't know. And then she said, Ishu boy, bad. Oh, oh, really? Oh. I was like, bro. <laughs> and you know, it stuck. So I don't know how she old, how old she is now, but thank you, Mariam. Thank you so much. I absolutely love that. A five-year-old has created your stamp on a song, which has lived with you now. I absolutely love it. What a brilliant story that is. I hope she's listening to this at some point. Yeah, I hope she is listening. Uh, (laughs) And it's so nice that you remember her name. I'm pretty sure this will get to her at some point. It will get to her. She was wearing my T-shirt, Hab. She was wearing my T-shirt. And um, yeah, I remember her clearly. I remember the whole scene. Mm-hmm. Well, I love that. Now, you know, I already know that, you know, you you have an ear for so many different genres in the world of music. You you listen to a lot of different things. But what's on your playlist right now? Who are you listening to out of interest? I What are you enjoying? I, I just downloaded uh, Jack Harlow's new song, First yeah. Class. First I Class. Beautiful. Yeah. Popular one. Yeah. And Big Bang. I don't know if you know Big Bang. K-pop. Like, yeah. They are the old. They made a return. So I was listening to their album, and what I've been, uh, I've been listening to a lot of music. Pasuri, I've been listening to a lot. That's I've been, been doing really well. Mm-hmm. That's been re- doing really well. That's I just saw it's uh, Spotify global top two hundred. Yeah. Um, I've been listening to, I Coldplay is like perpetually there, you know. Um, mm. Yeah, I've been also listening to. Um, Arabic Kutu, the, yeah, the yeah, very catchy, so very, very catchy. 
Yeah. It's, just, it's just nice to get an insight as to what's on your playlist. So I like that. Um, now, mm. on my breakfast show, I do I do a feature called Harp's Got Bars by the show where I pick somebody's track, I pick their instrumental and I drop a couple of bars. I know that you're a fan of this. I've commented. There you go, yeah. you've commented. Yeah. You did. Yeah. You, yeah. you liked one from the time that I did Bidgely Bidgely. I, I did Bidgely, um, Bidgely. Christmas tree. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Uh, go on. You know, party is... Is a great friend, you know. And when Bishli Bishli came out, I was like, everybody was like, you know, Jugnu and Bishli Bishli came out at the same time. Same time, yeah. Yeah, and I was like, I, do I like this song or do I like? <laughs> do I not like this song, you know? And then when I heard you, I swear, I'm not even kidding. When I heard you rapping on it, I was like, I think it's a nice song. Let's and then I went. Him. And then I went back to Bishli Bishli. I swear, I'm not even kidding. And then, and, and then I went back to Bishli Bishli. And then, you know, I was like, I, yeah, I think it's good. But I don't know. I think, I don't know. Yeah. Maybe it was the I, atmosphere. I am the reason you like that song. We, you are the reason you why I'm, I, I like the song. I was like, do, do I want to, like, you know, do I want to listen to it again? And see, we as music, I'm sorry, I'm having a grape. <laughs> <laughs> as you know, it's fine. <laughs> Get it's to the point, Baj. I need, I need to hear this. Finish the, finish the sentence. Sorry, I was good. I was like, I was like, I was like, we as musicians, we tend to, I'm sorry, oh God. <laughs> let, I'll let you finish your grape first. <laughs> we tend to, dis, you know, deconstruct the song and, you know, we get into the technicalities. And we're like, okay, this song is good, blah, 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 blah. Okay, it's a nice song. And then we lose the, the fun of listening to it. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Oh, you know. And then, because of you, I was like, oh, I think I need to enjoy the song. <laughs> I'm done with this. I'm done with this chat. I can't actually believe you're saying I made you love this yeah. song even more. My life is made. You've made yeah, my but day. Let me be honest. It was on the bars. It was. Oh, fine. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, but I didn't. I didn't. I didn't ask for that extra information. But I didn't to stop there. No, but, uh, <laughs> you have the control of the edit, so it's okay. <laughs> Well, anyway, my point is, I'm, I might even drop one, you know, on Voodoo at some point, but you don't rate my bars now, so what's the point doing it? <laughs> I think my one's back. I mean, I think it was because of your bars. <laughs> Fair enough. But anyway, you've made my day still, so I, I, I am going to love and leave you now, Bajra, but before I let you go, I keep hearing that you're coming to the UK. Is this year going to be that year? Uh, mm. You know, okay. Let me take this opportunity to let people know that I am UK, not only UK, uh, even the US. Uh, we haven't toured, right? It's been a long time because of yeah. the blah, blah, you know. The way the world I is, am, yeah. Exactly. I am, like, you You know me, like, when it comes to changing the scene or doing things to a level, I, I, I am up to that. Mm -hmm. so I am building the biggest, most amazing live tour ever by a Desi artist. I'm telling you, it's going to be a movie. It's not only going to be a movie, it's going to be Avengers. I'm telling you that. How long do we have to wait for this? You need, you need to give me some sort of timeline. It's just, it's just every day I'm working on it. You know, even, 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 in, you know, when I'm taking this break, I am working on it for the next two, three months. This is what my agenda is. to yes. the biggest, baddest live show, you know, like, everybody's gonna be proud of us that's, that's very exciting very exciting i mean yeah. even that in itself is an exclusive for me so i'll take that um but yeah. much, it's been an absolute pleasure as always catching Likewise, up with you here on the breakfast show it's been a long time but look i wish you all the best with the track i wish you all the best with everything that's coming um in the future and hopefully we'll catch up again soon but before i actually press play on voodoo today i would love for you to introduce it for me What's up, guys? Shoe Boy Badasha, and I'm so proud to present my brand new single with J Ballwing and Tiny, which is called Voodoo on the Breakfast Show with Hops.